uh, woke up with a fire burning, desire yearning yeah. to rise to a place of higher learning, apply to work and no question I But it takes a it. certain type of basketball player to want to play for me. He's got to be a, a total over the top in love with the game of basketball. Never been lying, never been mediocre with the rhymes. Never will see a moment when I'm sleeping on it because I keep it potent with You know, the culture, everybody talks about the Miami Heat culture. And uh, we'd like to build a little bit of that here, the St. John's culture, because it is a culture. And you have to change the culture. Every, every place I've taken over, they all fell on hard times because they had no current culture. So we need to bring back that strong culture where everybody's in this for one reason, to play for that name on the front. I had a handful of schools, a lot of schools actually, give me a chance after entering the portal. And I had visited two schools and St. John's is one of them. And immediately I touched the campus. Uh, I liked how uh, close it was and Coach Patino was, was a big factor in me choosing this place as well. I feel like it was more like a family oriented uh, recruiting process. I was connected with them. And then what really sold me was uh, when I got down here, I actually got to eat with uh, Coach P and uh, he actually told me like the realest stuff, like he kept 100 with me. And, uh, he didn't promise me anything or nothing like that, so I feel like that was perfect. The appeal that brought me to St. John's was one, it's close to my family, and two, playing under Coach P, giving me the chance to really make my dreams come true, so this was like the best of both worlds. You know, St. John's itself is, you know, in a very good conference, so, but it was really, I think Coach P was really the, the main factor. His demeanor, you know, his character, and then just the way he approached me and my family, you know, it was just very welcoming. I came out here and the love was just evident. He took me out to restaurants and he was super great with me. His love for the game I kind of really connected with because I love the game. And then we went and worked out and he, I felt like I got so much better in just a 45 minute workout that I was like, if I did this, you know, five days a week, I'd just be a really good basketball player. So after that, I, I was just, I knew where I had to be. Basketball is like my lifestyle now, eat, sleep, every day repeat the same thing. It's funny because when I first started, I was a football player. And then I felt like I was getting targeted in football because I was always a bigger person. So then I ended up starting in like third or fourth grade, my elementary team. And I just end up exceeding since then. Uh, it means everything to me. It's literally been my whole life. Like basketball brings you to meet tons of different people and like make millions and millions of connections with people that can help you even when you decide to step off the court. Basketball is really, it's a, it's a really fun activity, not only for me, but my entire family. We find joy in just watching and playing the game as well. So it started when I was uh, around 10, 11. I was just in a rec center with my brothers, uh, watching other guys, you know, play the game of basketball. And we didn't really know what we we're doing, but uh, we, we found joy and just playing the game, so we uh, got started around there. Basketball is great. Uh, I love the sport. My passion for basketball came at a young age. Uh, both my parents played the sport, so I kind of fell in love with it, and it's, you know, it runs through my blood. Basketball is my refuge in basically every aspect of my life. It's always something that I can go to. It never fails me. The first goal is just to get wins. That's what everybody wants to do. I don't want to like go out there and say that my goal is just to make the tournament. I want the ultimate goal is to win the Big East Championship and to win the National Championship. As much of a reach as it, as it may sound to people, like that's how I want like my like mentality to be. Like I'm, I'm here to win. I'm here to win as big as I possibly can, and that's the goal every season. You know, goals are you, you want to have goals, but really when you have a, a situation like we have, it's really about what are your pillars of the program, right? And getting back to your foundation of what's gonna make us great. You gotta have a strong roots, strong foundation. From there, you could have goals. What I'm hoping to build this year is really a competitive nature that I know all Coach P guys play with. Uh, the winning aspect, bringing that back here. Everybody wants to go to a program who, who wins. Just playing winning basketball and, and uh, not only showing New York, but showing everybody else uh, that St. John's is still here. For this team this year, I just feel like we just want to uh, set the tone for the years to come. It's, this is a year that's very important to all of us, so Coach P can keep on bringing in good teams and good people. And that's really what he's looking for. I think just the camaraderie we're going to build this year heading into next year, and then the next year, 
it's just it's going to be the biggest difference from this year's team and the team when I'm a senior or when I'm a junior. It's just we're all going to be so connected and so close as a group. I mean, we're going to have transfers coming in, but we're going to have a nucleus that, that have been here that, that can teach them and, and just show them like the way of Coach Patino and just the culture that we're trying to build. I've never seen a buzz like I've seen since we took the job in March. And to see New York City and the St. John's community this electric and kind of excited about the future. Um, and then knowing the product and the coaching will be there uh, because of Coach Patino is, is something that I'm really, really excited about. Let's go! We won't stop, we can't lose! We can't lose. There ain't much we can't do!